WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern time on Thursday, 30 minutes to go until that opening bell. And we got markets in the futures starting off in positive territory. Dow futures right now up 81 points, trading 26,941. We got the S&P futures up four at 3,001. NASDAQ futures up eight points, 7,937. Oil positive yet again, up eight pennies right now at $60.51. And we got the 10 year trading at 2.084%. As we start things off this morning, we'll jump over and we're gonna start it off with a couple news items coming out this morning. CPI, we've been waiting for this number. Biggest gain in nearly one and a half years. So the number here, overall CPI edged up 0.1% last month, held back by cheaper gasoline and food prices. We'll get into the core number here. Core number, excluding food and energy, rising 0.3% last month. I want to scroll down to the end of this article because to see the prices of oil, where are we? Uh, oil has risen a lot. They had it in this article. Too bad I can't find it real quick. Jobless claims also coming out at 830. Fall to three-month low, 209,000 unemployment for the month. Decent number as this economy marches on. With those two news items, we'll jump back to the charts, give you a little context of where we are this morning. There's your 8.30 a.m. volatility on that news. Currently, the Dow 26,948 had been about 30 to 40 points higher. NASDAQ 100. Pretty similar story. We were up at higher territory for most of the overnight session. NASDAQ 100 trading 79.41. Got a little bit of a negative reaction on that news. S&P is trading at 3,002. Had been up at 3,006 for most of that overnight trading. Crude oil almost made it to $61. Crude trading at $60.65. Gold contract, quite a run it had on the run yesterday, starting when Chairman Powell's remarks were made public at 8.30 a.m. yesterday morning, and we run all the way up to almost 14.30. You got gold trading at 14.18, and the Euro-U.S. dollar trading 112.71. Stay tuned, folks. You got a treat. Larry Pesimento coming up right now. I'll be back at 10 o'clock. Basil Chapman filling in for Tom. We got live programming all day at TFNN. Fed Chairman Powell back in front of Congress, this time in front of the Senate. He begins speaking at 10 a.m. Eastern time, I believe. Going to take some questions over there. Might be some headlines as they hit the market. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up right now.